All right, this is that guy in the right. This is Let's Play Shenmue 2. In the last episode, Ryo got to Hong Kong, and I showed off some things you can do. And I met, and I found Joy. Well, she found us. And I started spending the money. I just spent over a thousand bucks in a few hours. I spent it like it's been a freaking rot. Okay, let's continue on with the story. Blue Void Diner. Souvenirs. And across through here we get a cutscene. Sasukete, Uni-chan! Kuwai yo, kurosare chau yo! Ure, nani mo shite nai yo! けがしたくなかったら、おとなしく楽器を渡しな。どうするつもりだ。てめえには関係ねえよ。そうはいくか。死にてるらしいぞ。こんなところで死ぬつもりはない。もう今だ。待て。<笑><笑><笑><笑><
Worker's Pier. Going back to Worker's Pier. Which is where Pigeon Park is. Like I said, the, the areas in this game are much, much bigger. In between safe spot, safe things. But if I really wanted to, there's a glitch you can do that allows you to skip load time, which is kind of weird. And it allows you to skip cutscenes and stuff like that if you really wanted to. I'm not going to do it because I'm not very good at doing it. I'd be spending like 20 minutes just trying to get it done. And here we go. So, where are あいつだ。あ、やばい。待て。バッグを返せ。知らないよ。Yep. And the funny thing is, Wong is also one of those characters that become pretty big for the story. And it's also kind of fun. Well, like like most people, like most child male characters. Oops. See you, man. Back up, after. An actor over on accident. She, he's actually voiced by a female in the English version, but not in the Japanese. Well, Japanese and European version. Which is kind of funny. Oops. Damn it! I hope I didn't mess this up. Damn it! So, you lost it. Okay, it looks like... Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I'm not on my A game today. I guess it might be the last play curse. I've never lost him. Crap. Alright. Okay. Let's see if we can go back to Pigeon Park and reinitiate this, the chase. すいません。はい。緑色の服。ゴンのこと。その子です。一度見つけて追いかけたんですが、途中で見失って。なんだかさっきから近くで声がするの。近くですか。多分この裏の方だと思うの。よかったらちょっと。オールライト。僕は聞
バッグを返してもらおう苦しいもうやめてよ悪かったよ俺がバッグのあるところに連れて行くから本当だなこっちだよ Okay, this is another new aspect of the game. It's called Chase, where you pretty much just put your controller down and watch the game. Not, you know, not the most fun thing, but, you know, it's a lot easier, a lot easier than just trying to follow a person. Like, and I think this is the only time in the entire game where you can actually use it. There's one part later where you have to follow somebody, but you can't lock onto them like this, or else, you, or else they find you. And I'll mention that. I'll bring that up when that part comes. You can talk to him. Just talk to him. He just says the same things over and over. And this is probably the creepiest, one of the creepier things I've seen in the game. You got a grown man following a little boy. So no one's calling the cops. This is creepy. I just realized that QT segment allowed it, allowed me to skip the uh, night animation. So, hmm, okay, whatever. Let's go. Buzz is here.金だけ抜き取ったな。俺じゃないよ。本当だよ。奴らのところへ案内しろ。金はラリーたちが爆地で。なんだと？本当だよ。あっという間に使っちゃったんだよ。ごめんなさい。何でもするからガンベしてよ